Hello everyone, in this particular lecture, we will learn about that how we can take the user input with the help of prompt method in your JavaScript, right? So what is prompt? Well, your prompt method opens a pop-up where the user can enter some text, right? So one thing which is very important about prompt is that it always returns a string. So either the user input a number or either a string it will always return a string right and if the user presses cancel in that case it returns the null this is also very important because when you click the cancel in the prompt in that case you get a null from your javascript right so we can use that null in our conditions and we are going to use that in our further so let's start right so let's take a variable that const age input equals to prompt bracket inside of this please enter your age we can write like this after that we can put the condition like if if age input is not equals to equals to null I told you earlier that if the user enters or presses the cancel button in that case it returns a null that that he or she has not entered anything they have cancelled it so if they cancelled that there's no need right so that's why we are putting the input that if age input is not equals to null in that case only you do the further condition checking right so we can write const age equals to now since your prompt returns a string right that's why for converting it into a number right because age will be in number so we will write number like this after that we put the bracket and we write age input because that particular input has stored inside this particular age input so we converted the age input now right after that now we put few conditions that if age sorry if is nan right age that means if your age is not a number basically this condition says like this and we have put the exclamation mark which says that your particular age is a number now in such case you will give the alert as your age is then put a equals to sign and then age right like this so we want that a alert come which says that your age is this particle right after that we can put else you say alert and inside of this we will write this is not a valid number this is not a valid number right because uh, in case the user had input some made the input as some string right like hello and other in the age section so if this particular number will not be able to convert it into a number right because that's a string basically so in that particular case it will sh say that this is not a valid number right and after that we can write else else for this particular condition that age is not equals to null in that particular case we can make the alert as we need to cover every edge cases right you cancel right like this so this is the whole logic which we are needed right now let's see that whether it is working or not so let's see let's uh, reload the website as you can see now it is asking for enter your age so let's enter 12 right and I click on ok in that particular case it is showing me that your age is 12 right now let's do it again and let's say that uh, I enter some string like hello and if I click on ok in that particular case that this is not a valid number and let's do it by clicking on cancel right directly cancel in that particular case that you cancel means every edge case is working properly and this is how we take the user input with the help of JavaScript, as you can see here, right? So this is about today's video. 
thank you so much for watching we will meet in the next video very soon till then goodbye